Hey everybody, I've been saying that the Jerboa needs another way to get apples for a while now, and well, you know what they say about being careful what you wish for. The worm is now a tier 2 unit that gives us an apple every turn, and the owl also gives us a mouse every turn. So now instead of just having apples and the mouse, we have guaranteed apples every single turn for our Jerboa to eat. And, well, I'll let you see how strong it is for yourself. But anyways, if you like the video, like the video. Enjoy the rest of the video. And then, uh, Hoopo Bird is insanely strong. Shop Pet's current tier. Don't care. We're looking for a worm. Do you think Dredge is worth it? I think so. It's pretty good. We're just going to give it to the owl for now. Would like a worm. Doesn't seem like we're going to get one. But maybe just level three owl is good enough. I am just looking for level 2 owl. There's the worm. Another worm? <laughs> Maybe we'll do this. Owl 2 worm Jerboa. I think Wild Frost is worth the $20. Wild Frost is 100% worth the money. I think Wild Frost is fantastic. All right. Show me Jerboa. Dang it. <laughs> oh, that would have been great. Are you bugged? That was a level one mouse. Oh, no, I just leveled you up. Never mind. I'm not paying attention. Um, seagull axolotl combos that would be good uh, we just want jerboa we roll for it And then we go buy, uh, sell, buy some more. Level, uh, level twoing you, I think, is our main goal, though. And we draw. Oh, there's so many apples. Oh, it's beautiful. We need the level up though. You got the same idea, but I think we uh, got there quicker. Oh, if only the Jerboa was level 2. Maybe I should have rolled before selling there and looking for a chocolate. Yeah, there it is. Wait, oh. wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. We go... We try Rhino Flying Squirrel. Yeah. 
Yeah, go here. We'll hold on to you just for a second. Well, I guess a mushroom on you is what we would prefer. Right? Get rid of the worm. You're maybe right. <laughs> maybe you're right. Whoops. <laughs> Fed the wrong thing there. And then we go mushroom. Wait, this is about to be crazy. Oh, but you don't kill it. <laughs> we got to kill it in order for it to do something. I, yeah, I guess mushroom isn't because it won't guarantee kill. So I guess mushroom doesn't make sense. Um... Uh, yeah, so probably chili instead. Or bell pepper. We just we just keep dying. <laughs> the rhino just keeps dying. One of these days, though. Level three rhino. Now rhino goes off. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Kill. Nice. Isn't Flying Squirrel just worse tiger? Well, the reason the Flying Squirrel is good is because it's for adjacent pets, so it would work for two. And it does, at level three, it's nine damage. So, like, on a Hedgehog, it would be 11 damage instead of multiplying it by two. If that makes sense. Let's, let's see if we can find links. So it'll deal six extra damage. I mean, obviously a level three links would be better with this, but and crocodile would be good. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. See, that is the situation where if we have a uh, angler fish, we can get a sloth. I think tennis ball is always the way to go here. Armadillo teams? I haven't gone against an armadillo team, have I? New lionfish on faint deals damage based on its attack. Two X amount of targets based on every 10 attack it has. At level three, it'll do 15 damage for every 10 attack it has. So 75 total damage. If level three and 50. Level 
Looks like it's worm team. Yeah, we'll just go straight up Jerboa Worm team here. See how good it can be. Feed you. Level up here. Giraffe is fine. Actually, no. We would rather just get the free mouse. New snail's bad. Yeah, new snail's not great. Fajita, thank you so much for the sub. We need level up on owl. Jerboa? How about Jerboa? No, we'll wait. We'll wait. So many people seem to be going for the same build. <laughs> Actually, we'll just get rid of the ant. I don't even care. The two gold apples aren't that great either. Just looking for owls or worms. That's a lot of worms. More worms. <laughs> so many apples. All right. We've done it. We've done it. Give me level three owl. I want level two Jerboa. New worm at the start of battle will give us an apple. It gives us a better apple, which is plus two, plus two, and an apple, depending on its level. And they always cost two. Level two Jerboa is what we care about the most. Don't even care about the cow. Level three owl is also what we care about. Oh, this is great. Start of turn, sorry, that's the start of battle. Once we get you level two, it's game over. Show it to me. Oh, show it to me, please. Pistol, thank you for the seven months. Choosing your level up pet is an absolute game changer. I think it's a great change, though. All right, don't sell this mouse yet. We would love a chocolate. Okay, well, <laughs> it replaces shop food. Okay, well, now we can do it. And then level two, hold anglerfish just in case we go up against a sloth. 
We're holding this anglerfish for the rest of the game. <laughs> Uh, Kino, sorry, but I think the owl is stronger than the worms. Oh my goodness, this is so strong. New owl's really cool. It does require four slots, but... What does Anglerfish do? Uh, you choose a level one pet from your last opponent and it uh, is added to your shop. And honestly, I don't even think you need worms. I think just the owl Jerboa combo is great. But I mean, this is turn 12, and we almost have four 50s. We'll get it in like a turn. I don't think there's any really point for rolling for apples. See, everybody's, everybody's sleeping on the owl. They're all trying worm. All right, I mean, maxed out shop. Almost maxed you out. So close. I mean, four maxed out units on 13, I think is kind of strong. Okay, well... That's a good combo, if anyone was curious. 